Good morning. Happy Monday. Hello, hello everyone. Uh, it's Monday and it's one of my favorite, favorite days of the week because on a Monday I am fresh, I am uh, chilled and I am ready to smash it. So how do I usually make sure that I achieve what I want to achieve in a week? A lot of times we just, you know, start on Monday and then we get a little bit scrambled along the week and we forget what we want to do. We lose focus. So I've got a few tips that really, really help me. And as long as I stick to the plan that I made, then I am able to fit in not only my job, also my business, my family and the free time for myself, me, myself and I. So those are my top tips. Get organized. This is really something that is so important and so many people actually lack. It took me years to understand what this actually means. So get organized. How does that look in my life? I have a planner, a physical planner in front of me on my desk all the time where I have literally blocked off the times of how and when I'm going to do stuff. So for example, at 7 a.m. I do my workout, 7 until 8, it's my workout time. And guess what? I woke up this morning, I did not want to get out of bed. I did not, I am just being completely honest here with you, I didn't want to get out of the bed. It's miserable, it's cold, it's dark, and the bed is just so nice and cozy, and I could have stayed in. They didn't want to get out, but I said, no, I'm doing this. I got out of the bed, I made myself some protein coffee here for powering up my workouts and all that. And uh, then I did high intensity interval training for 20 minutes. By the way, that is quite intense. Um, then I did some weights. And after that, I finished with my squat challenge. Today I did 80 squats. So all of that took me less than one hour. In the meantime, my child woke up and she was here with me the whole time while I was doing my exercise. So she didn't prevent me or I didn't get distracted while she was here. I did it while she was watching me. And why is that important? Is because you are setting an example to your children at home. They're watching you. They're watching your habits. They're looking at you every single morning and seeing how you deal with your life. And this is how they are going to deal with their lives. So set a good example. It's not easy. You are gonna lack motivation. Motivation is a myth, by the way. This is why we're creating habits. Strong habits become really, really powerful. And even when you don't wanna do it, you do it because you're used to doing it and then everything else falls into place. So that's one. And now for me, it's time to get in the shower. I had my breakfast and I'm going to start working on my science, on my job. So today I know exactly what I'm going to do. I already made a plan of what I need to research and how I'm going to do it. So I'm going to do this. I even have time blocked out for lunch and then more science. And then in the evening, I literally put into my diary block of time and I wrote family time. What does that mean? That means that I'm going to put my phone away, put my laptop away, put everything away. And that's going to be time when I spend with my daughter, with my partner. We're going to have dinner. We're going to play family games. We're going to watch TV, whatever we want to do without any distractions. And this is how you can fit everything in your life. It is not difficult. All you need to do is organize yourself. A lot of people come to me and say, I don't have the time. Well, here I am showing you that you can be employed, you can have a job, have a business, have a child and still do everything that you want. You just need a little bit of guidance and a little bit of organization. So what we do in my team, in my team, I teach people how to organize, how to set plans in the beginning of every week and how to stick to those plans with accountability groups, with accountability buddies and how to continue doing it, not just for 21 days when we run 21 day challenges, but also beyond that. So get going, get set for Monday, organize yourself. And if you need any help or if you want to join my community, message me and I will include you into my free community on Facebook. And by the way, we're about to run a free five day have your cake and eat it challenge. 
and this is going to be absolutely fantastic. So I'm looking forward to seeing you all there. Have a fantastic Monday. Bye-bye. Uh, this dance not going so well.